1440 KVON 99.3 The Vine. This is Kelly. It's time for Healthy Communities brought to you by St. Helena Hospital. I have two folks with me this morning. I have Dr. Rodney Look and Miss Nia Landaris. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Hi. So, um, Dr. Look, um, Chairman of, De- of Department of Emergency Medicine at St. Helena Hospital, No Weight ER, and Chief of Staff Elect. Good morning. Tell us a little bit about yourself. Well, I'm uh, uh, an yeah, phys- ER physician here that's uh, originally from Colorado and spent a lot of time doing international uh, emergency medicine, mainly in Africa. I worked as a medical missionary for a long time. Uh, and I did it after I was an archaeologist, so I sort of came into medicine late and um, now live uh, here locally. All right, and we're going to talk to um, Nia Landaris in just a moment, but tell us, what does this mean, no weight ER? How is that even possible? <laughs> Well, that's a good question. We actually uh, are fortunate here at St. Helena to be able to have a community hospital where we actually have sort of a high acuity but low volume ER. Basically what that means is that we have the capacity to take you in right as you walk in the door. So we do something called direct triage, which is what we call no weight, meaning that when you come in and you've either hurt yourself uh, with a knife uh, because you were cutting some uh, bagel in the morning or you uh. have chest pain and you have, are having a heart attack, you come directly back no matter what it is. If it's a a minor complaint or a major uh, critical situation, we can put you in a bed immediately where you'll be uh, triaged not only by a nurse, but you'll get put right into emergency medicine bed versus waiting in the waiting room until a bed is available for you. I see. And then you also have a fully operational heliport. Tell us about that. Yeah, well, exactly that. So heliports are uh, very important for emergency rooms for two reasons. One is that we can take anything in and we can send anything out. So we don't have pediatrics per se here, but so if there was a critical situation, we could fly someone out. But what we also fly in are uh, chest pains from everywhere from Lake County to uh, locally here, which Neil and Darius could speak to a little bit as far as our uh, chest pain center here. Yeah, now Neil, Neil Landeris is the cardiac clinical specialist. Good morning. Good morning. Tell us about what the services that you offer in that department. So what's really important nationally is that we try to open a clogged artery in the heart within 90 minutes. Okay. The longer a person waits, the more heart muscle can die. So when we know a patient's coming in with a clogged artery called a STEMI heart attack, we can immediately get them through our ED and to the cath lab where a cardiologist and the team can get blood flowing back to that heart. So if we try to open that vessel within 90 minutes at St. Helena Hospital, we've actually had patients that have what's called a door to balloon time within 19 minutes. Oh my gosh, that's incredible. Now talk about, um, Nia, the um, brand vision statement. What is that? Well, we talk about living younger, longer. Mm -hmm. So a lot of people think, oh, I'm getting old. I can't walk as far. Oh, I'm getting Mm. old. I'm a little short of breath. I'm getting old. My knees don't feel so good. And what we remind people that it's not just a process of aging. There are things that we can do to let you live younger, longer. You can have your knees replaced. You can have a workup that says it's not really that you're getting old, but that maybe there are some clogged arteries in your legs or in your heart that are preventing you from living a full, active life as though you were young. I see. Well, that and that's what St. Helena Hospital is all about. Absolutely. Absolutely. Keeping you young and healthy. <laughs> I love that. What else do we need to know? Well, one of the great things about our emergency room is that it actually acts as a front door to all of our specialty services here. We're very blessed uh, to have a community hospital. Not only it serves the needs of the community, but we have all of these specialty uh, physicians and uh, institutes that are affiliated or within our hospital. Uh, Case in point is the Kuhn Institute, which is a joint replacement uh, center we have here with uh, some of the world's best physicians doing these joint replacements. We also have uh, top-notch plastic surgeons cardiothoracic surgeons, and all the great specialty services that usually small hospitals like this have to send people out. We have them all here, from ear, nose, throat to ophthalmology. And not only that, but us as ER physicians know them well. We call them by first name at home and say, gosh, could you come in and help us out with this specialty situation that requires your expertise? And we have them right here in the community. And our emergency medicine department allows that door to be open for you. That's amazing. Is there a website we can get more information? Absolutely. 
Um, St. Helena Hospital dot org. St. Helena Hospital dot org. I will put this on my blog this morning. I'll put the link at kvyn or kvon dot com. Uh, Dr. Look and Neil Landaris, thank you so much for being with us this morning. Thank you for having me. Our pleasure. Thank Absolutely. You. Healthy Communities is brought to you by St. Helena Hospital. So it's a no-wait ER with a dedicated care team waiting for you when you arrive, a heliport on site just in case you need it. So we've learned a little bit more. We're going to continue on with this segment in the coming weeks and learn more about staying healthy and young. I like that, staying young. All right, it's 855, 1440 KVON. 99.3 The Vine.